issues um, through our section today. And then we've got the second position would be worried about being expensive. And I think we're here today to go on and tell you the expectation is totally the other way around. And you'll actually end up spending a lot less for food uh, on a plant-based diet. And we'll go through that in the shopping sections as well. And then not sure where to get it and some other reasons. So it seems like many different kind of concerns. And we'll cover off, I think, most of these uh, tonight. But that's really good to know. So thanks, thanks for sharing that. Uh, can we go back to the slide? So um, this is just a little explanation about plant-based versus vegan versus whole food plant-based. I know some people have probably kind of heard these terms around and it's a little bit confusing. And, and to be honest, even in the vegan community, sometimes we all get confused with these labels. So I thought I'd make it simple for you. So it's, it's quite simple. Vegans, we avoid things to do with animals, you know, the use of or consumption or the exploitation of. So you can break it out into food and then everything else. So starting at the everything else. So a vegan wouldn't wear leather. You know, they wouldn't go to a circus, for example. They wouldn't uh, bet on horse racing. You know, things to do with, with animals uh, in other food products, other than food products. And on the food side, you can consider it like a plant-based diet is a vegan diet. So we'll be using both terms tonight, and they are essentially the same thing. So when you hear about like, oh, I, I'm on a plant-based diet, it means a diet, the same diet that a vegan is on. And a vegan is automatically on a plant-based diet, by definition. Now, within that, you may hear the term a whole food plant-based diet, and sometimes the you know, shortened to WFPB. So you may see that around on the internet. Um, and in chats. And that basically means an unprocessed, kind of like healthy version um, of a vegan diet. So on the other hand, you can also get you know, vegan snacks, and you can get vegan like junk food, and you can get lots of vegan stuff. And it's actually kind of terrible. There's so many good, tasty, tempting products these days for vegans. Um, sometimes you have to be careful about what you eat. Um, but for example, Oreo is the classic example. Oreo is a vegan. So, um, you know, Oreos, I can't stand up here and say that's a healthy food. So anyway, today we're mostly going to be talking about um, whole food, plant-based uh, diets.